Also here at 11 religious groups protesting the Dodgers 10th annual Pride Night, an event that in celebrates inclusion and diversity. The groups had rallied against an activist organization made up of drag queens dressed as nuns. That's right, but the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence say they had no issue with the protests. Thousands of demonstrators briefly blocked the entrance to Dodger Stadium. They protested against the nuns, saying that they mocked the Catholic religion. The protests were largely peaceful, though. Chris Wolf joining us live from Dodger Stadium, where celebration and condemnation were on full display tonight. Chris? Yeah, that's right, Rick and Cher. There was an extra heavy police presence outside Dodger Stadium today, but we can tell you there were no major problems or arrests connected to these demonstrations. They came by the hundreds, if not thousands, swarming around Dodger Stadium for Pride Night 2023. Throngs of the Faithful, a coalition of Catholic and Christian groups and activists protesting what they consider an affront to their religion and core belief. Jesus Christ is not only our Lord, he's the Lord of America. Before the Dodgers took on the San Francisco Giants, they paid special tribute to a group called the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence. The members in drag are heavily made up with different names and personas, but all don variations of their traditional nun's habit. That fact distresses or outrages countless Catholics and Christians, driving many of them to demonstrate and rally before Friday night's game, the culmination of weeks of fiery debate and flip-flopping. First, the Dodgers invited the sisters to Pride Night, then disinvited them, then re-invited them. Finally, on the field, when the stadium was still fairly empty before the festivities, the ball club honored the group with the 2023 Community Hero Award for charitable and humanitarian work. That filled me not only with joy and gladness, but a sense of safeness and security and a sense that who I am, as ridiculous as this may be, is welcome on the face of the earth. I think everyone's after a good cause. Even though that happened, people could kind of learn a lesson from it and still be able to love and like invite people and just be open with everybody. Not everyone is supportive. Yeah, my concerns is that they're not sisters uh, and they're ridiculing the good sisters in the Catholic Church. We're here to pray for them as well because we don't know um, why they feel that that they need to do this. So. As activists, we cannot fault anyone for using protests to express their First Amendment rights. We hope that the people remain vociferous, but peaceful. We will honor our king. The San Francisco Giants beat the Dodgers 7-5 in extra innings. Next up will be the Dodgers Christian Faith and Family Day on July 30th. Live at Dodger Stadium, Chris Wolf. KTLA 5 News. All right, Chris, thanks for that.